ナモアミダブツナモアミダブツナモアミダブツナマンダーナマンダーブナマンダーブ Hello everyone, welcome to Tsukiji Honganji YouTube channel. Please look at the central altar Naijin in the main hall Hondo. It is where Amida Buddha is enshrined. What is your impression of the altar of Jodo Shinshu? I think many people are impressed by the color of shining gold. Some people might say that the Buddha is so gorgeous, but this golden color doesn't mean the gorgeousness or richness. One of Amida Buddha's vows is called the vow that all beings in Amida's land be of golden color, which says, If, when I attain Buddhahood, the humans and devas in my land should not all be the color of genuine gold, may I not attain the perfect enlightenment. In other words, Amida Buddha always sees the life of each and every one of us as shining gold. Gold symbolizes the universal value. So, this Amida's vow teaches us that no matter what may happen to you or however depressed you may be, your life has unchangeable great value. On the other hand, what about us? I think we mostly judge each other by the outside of the people, such as educational background, career, occupation, status, achievement, etc. Unfortunately, this way we cannot see every single life as gold. Sometimes we hurt someone or get hurt by someone through stereotyping or being labeled. That's why Amida Buddha couldn't help vowing so. Hearing Amida's vow is also reflecting ourselves. I am not justifying the way we are, but at least I would like to be aware of my self centeredness. And most importantly, even if you cannot accept yourself or cannot find any value in yourself, Amida Buddha tells you that you are always shining gold. The word Namo Amida Butsu. Is the very call of Amida Buddha that embraces me anytime, anywhere, which means right now, right here. So let's recite Nembutsu and hear the Buddha's call together. Namo Amida Butsu, Namo Amida Butsu, Namo Amida Butsu, Namandav, Namandav, Namandav.